So following a transient or one of these brief sudden onset vascular events, your risk tends to be highest earliest. So as we've discussing in some of the previous discussions, at seven days it's thought to be about 10%, and then at about a month it's 12 to 15%. And what we, what we know is that treating in the right way, doing the right test can reduce that risk. But the easiest way to talk about risk is if I show you a little graph. So on your x-axis you've got time and on your y-axis you've got your risk of stroke. So the risk is higher as you go up and this is time. And what happens in that early phase your risk is up to here and then it sort of plateaus out after this point. Okay, so the risk is highest at seven days and then it plateaus out. But what we know is being on the right treatment can drop that to like this. So risk being low. So the key thing is identifying it early, getting put on the right treatment. That risk goes from this to this.